Hello, and welcome back to Off Grid Style. I'm Nikki. Today we're discussing another video in our Wilderness Survival Series, and this video is Tips to Stay Alive in the Wilderness. And this is geared for everybody. Um, everyone probably has something they can learn or be reminded of about how to stay alive in the wilderness if you find yourself in that situation. There's people who spend all their time in the wilderness. There are people who maybe live in an urban area and the wilderness to them is a place they're having to go maybe if an SHTF situation occurs. So hopefully this is something for everybody. Let's get started. Wilderness Survival Tips to Stay Alive If you enjoy this video, please consider liking, commenting, and subscribing. Surviving in the wilderness is an endeavor that requires resourcefulness, knowledge, and a cool head. Whether you're an experienced outdoors enthusiast or find yourself in an unexpected wilderness situation, these tips can help you stay alive and increase your chances of making it back safely. First, you must prioritize shelter. In any type of extreme weather, exposure can quickly become life-threatening. Build or find shelter to protect yourself from the elements. Natural features like caves or overhangs can work, but knowing how to construct a makeshift shelter using available materials is crucial. Please note, we have a video on wilderness shelter building on our channel. Finding and getting water. Water is vital for survival. Learn to find and purify water sources. We also have a video on this on our channel. If you will look in the description, there will be links to all of these. Even water that appears stagnant can be made safe through filtration, boiling, or chemical treatment. Fire making skills are very important as well. Fire provides warmth a way to purify water and cook any food, and a psychological boost. Always carry a fire starting tool like waterproof matches, lighters, or a fire starter. And also learn primitive methods like fire by friction as a backup. Understand navigation. If you're lost in the wilderness, use a map and compass or a GPS device if available. It is also important for you to familiarize yourself with basic navigation techniques like tracking the sun's movement or using natural landmarks. Signaling for rescue, though preferably not what they note in a bottle. In dire situations, make yourself visible to potential rescuers. Use signaling tools like whistles, mirrors, or fire to attract attention. Remember that three of anything, blows of a whistle or flashes of light, is usually recognized as a distress signal. And now let's discuss first aid. Basic first aid knowledge is invaluable. Carry a compact first aid kit and understand how to treat common wilderness injuries like cuts, sprains, and insect bites. Most importantly, you need to stay calm. Panic can cloud your judgment and lead to poor decisions. Take deep breaths, assess your situation, and formulate a plan. Stay hydrated and nourished. Ration your available supplies of food and water. Conserve energy by avoiding unnecessary activities and stay hydrated to prevent dehydration. It's important to be aware of wildlife. Know the wildlife in the area you're exploring or have bugged out to. Avoid confrontations and store food away from your shelter to prevent animal encounters. Stay dry and warm. Hypothermia can set in quickly, even in milder cold temperatures. Keep your clothing dry, wear layers, and use insulation like leaves or debris in your shelter. 
Learn about edible plants and foraging. Familiarize yourself with edible wild plants in your area. Foraging for food can supplement your supplies. We do have a video on edible weeds. I will link that in the description. If at all possible, you need to stay informed. Before your adventure, inform someone of your plans and expected return time. If it is an SHTF situation, try to take a hand crank radio or some other form of communication with you. If it is just a camping trip and you are overdue, the people you tell can alert authorities. Build your skills. Regularly practice wilderness survival skills so they become second nature. Join survival courses or groups to learn from experienced individuals. Carry essential gear. Have a well-equipped survival kit with items like a multi-tool, flashlight, emergency blanket, and a fully charged cell phone with a portable charger for emergencies. We do have a video on EDC or everyday carry items that I will link in the description. Having a positive mindset. Maintaining hope and a positive mindset is crucial. Focus on staying alive and never give up. Surviving in the wilderness demands preparation, knowledge, and the ability to adapt to challenging circumstances. Obviously, these tips are not exhaustive, but they do serve as a foundation for wilderness survival. And please don't forget to check out the other videos in the description to learn more. Well, I hope you learned something from the video a tip or a trick or something along those lines, please let me know in the comments if you have anything to add. Again, you guys are brilliant about this stuff, so I always love to hear from you. I think that a lot of times we learn from each other, I hope. So tell me what you thought. Like, subscribe, comment, all those good things, and I see you all again soon.